my name is Efford Silva and today we're going to be taking a look at a WordPress tutorial on how to recover your lost username and password. Now without your username and password you can't be able to log into your dashboard, your WordPress dashboard. So before we can take a look on how to recover the lost password, we need to create a, a WordPress installation. I'm installing WordPress on my local machine and for you, you you might be live on the internet, you might be live on the web, but whichever way is still the same process that you're going to follow. So I'm just trying to install WordPress on my machine now. Uh, like I said before, I'm installing locally. Just trying to add username and password. Take note of the username and password that I'm using. In this case, I'm using WordPress or lowercase as the password. And I'm using WordPress initial cap as the username. Take note because we are going to be needing it after now. So let's log into our dashboard using WordPress, the username which is WordPress all caps, um, initial cap, that means the first letter in capital letters then others in small and the password WordPress or in lower caps. Okay, yeah, is our dashboard. This is a WordPress dashboard. This is what you're going to be seeing on anytime you log into your dashboard. From here, you can change a team, add a new team, add post and other things. Um, let me quickly create new pages and new team on this WordPress that I just created now. I'm creating new posts, new I want to create about five posts so that we can see we can see what we are doing very well. So I've created like two now. So like we all know WordPress is one of the best platform and it covers one third of the internet. One third of every website hosted on the internet is created with WordPress. So imagine creating a website and you can't update, make any update again. So that is it, our website is working perfectly well. And maybe one day you just try to log in to your dashboard to make one or two maybe you want to create a new post or you want to create you want to create a new post or you want to create a new page or you just want to make one or two updates on your website and you find that you've forgotten your username your password or you've forgotten the email you use in creating your WordPress. Don't worry because you, there's no need for alarm. This tutorial is going to cover you on how you can recover them back. Like this now, I'm just trying a random email, a random password, but it's not going to work because that's not the username and that's not the password. So I'll just keep trying. By eventually, maybe it will work. But if you ever encounter this issue don't think that you've lost your website don't start creating deleting your files from your host the very first thing you need to do is to use the lost your password that wordpress gives you but in using this you need to enter your email address so that you can recover your password what if you cannot access your email ad you or you cannot remember your email the use in creating the account well you don't need to worry 
just follow the few steps that I'm going to be showing you on how you can access you can know your email the email you use because if you don't know the right email you use WordPress will not send you a reset code now I used I created my account on a lo my local machine so I am on my hosting account now now what we are looking for we are looking for WP hyphen config dot php file open that file and under the db name you see the your database name because without your database name you cannot you find it difficult to trace to get, get to the next step so that's why you need to know your database name so in my case is wp tutorial dot com now on my php my admin I've located my database name click on WP options and there I can see my admin email under the admin underscore email in my case is f 4 silver one at gmail.com so with this now I can go back and enter the correct email then click click on get new password it's loading and now for any reason you get this that your account cannot send email or the email you you it sends and you are not getting the email a reset password in your gmail account or your email address don't worry all you need to do is to change it manually from your php my admin dashboard so i just logged into my php my admin dashboard clicked on my database and located WP users that's what you're looking for WP underscore users there you see your account click on edit I like to load then change the password that is there remove it entirely and type a new password under the users underscore pass remove everything that is there and type a new password in this case i want to type enjoy yourself i want to change the new password to be enjoy yourself so i'm typing it now enjoy yourself then remember to change the functions to md5 it's a hashing code is the old part uh, old hashing code that um wordpress uses before now after that is done you see the updates you updated the rule now login with the username you saw there wordpress and the new password you just created which is in my case enjoy yourself then click on login and here we are we just logged into our dashboard so all the teams the post everything we created they're all there and they're working perfectly well so this is how you can recover your password your username and your password if you forget it all you just need to do is log into your your hosting account and follow the steps that i showed you if you look at here you see all the posts we created before they're all there Live is a passage, tea break, enjoy WordPress the best platform. The everything is working perfectly well. So yes, I think that's the end of this video. Please please if you like this video, please like, share and subscribe for more WordPress tips. Thank you so much.